Hello, my name is Stan and today we are reviewing GeoSurf Residential Proxy Service. GeoSurf is a premium business proxy residential network with over 2 million residential IPs in 130 countries. They have an excellent onboarding process that allows you to quickly start with their proxy service. Their prices start from $300 per month, which gives you 20 gigabytes of monthly uh, bandwidth, and you can purchase, pur purchase additional bandwidth for $15 per gigabyte. They have additional uh, packages, uh, which, uh, which are called Professional Plus. Uh, the only difference between them is the amount of bandwidth you're committed to. By the way, if you watch this video till the end, at the end of the video we will present you a very nice bonus or present specifically tailored to the GeoSurf services. Once you purchase the GeoSurf service, you will get access to, to their dashboard. And here you can basically set up your account settings and set up the GeoSurf IP get gateways. Before we do that, you need to go to the account settings and click on manage your IP section. In this section, you'll basically need to whitelist the IPs from where you will be accessing their, uh, their proxies. After you've done that, you can go to GeoSurf Gateways, where you specifically, specifically can set up the proxies. Let's go there and see what they offer. Uh, the first service that you can see is the Random Country High Rotation Proxy. Uh, basically, this proxy will rotate uh, IPs very frequently. Uh, this specifically is advised only if you're building some scraping or crawling service. If you're managing social accounts, then definitely this is something that you don't need. Instead, it's best to use either the sticky IP or city IPs otherwise. Let's take a look at how their city IPs look like. Let's click on city IP. And now we can choose a country, state and city where these IPs will be accessed from. Let's choose United States. Uh, state will be New York and city, let's choose Brooklyn. Now we can see that GeoSurf offers us specific gateways that we can use in our profiles, uh, specific gateway proxies. And you can see that there's different times associated with each gateway. This basically tells what is the minimum time this proxy will live for. So one minute will live for one minute, 10, 10 minutes and 30 is 30 minutes. And after that time, there is a potential, there's a probability that the IP will change. If we are managing social accounts, then we'll definitely need the 30 minute one. Now you can see the, they provide a proxy host, a port, username of that proxy and the password. Before we set it up with multi-login, we will need to, with, with multi-login profiles, we need to launch the plugin. We have a specific plugin that is tailored for GeoSurf connection. We can simply go to plugin section, find GeoSurf right here and click activate. I already had it activate, so I de deactivated for a second, but you click activate and it's ready to go. Now we can go ahead and create a new profile and choose the browser, uh, proxy settings, and here we can choose our GeoSurf to use it for this profile. But I have already a profile set up right here, which is GeoSurf City US. Let's go ahead and check. Here I have provided the, uh, the gateway which they gave me, the port, and the login. As you can see, the login actually controls to which city this profile will connect to. Let's check where this proxy connects to. And we can see there the external IP is US1 with a time zone in Brooklyn. Let's go ahead and try and launch this profile and see where it connects to exactly. Okay, so now we are connected to this proxy. Let's go to whoer.net and see what IP we got exactly. So as I can see, the uh, IP is indeed from Brooklyn, uh, United States, and ISP is Verizon Fios, which is an internet service provider, which basically means that it's a residential IP address. Awesome. Let's take a look at how their sticky IPs work, because this might actually interest some of you who are managing 
social accounts. In managing multiple social accounts, you want your IPs to change as, ra as rarely as possible. So in GeoSurf, you are able to use the sticky IP. In order to use sticky IP, you will need to choose state IP and then sticky IP. Currently, this service is only provided in three countries, Canada, Germany, and United States. Let's, for example, use United States, choose a state, let's say New York. Okay, and it gives us the gateways which we can utilize to connect to that specific sticky IP. As you can see, I already have a profile created right here with these gateways as well. Let's go to edit settings. As you can see, GeoSurf provides us a pool of ports which we can connect to. This is done so that you can assign each port for each profile that you create. And thus you can have different IP addresses at the same time and having uh, multiple profiles open with different IP addresses. So I have, uh, I will place the 13 minutes sticky IP right here, place it in the host and choose some port within this pool. So if it's like this, we will just place it right here and let's say we choose 61 and let's check where this connects to. As we see, it connects to a US IP address. Let's go and see what IP we got exactly. So there's my GeoSurf Sticky US profile and let's launch it. Okay, so the profile is launched. Let's go to whoer.net and see what exact IP address we got. And as we can see, we got an IP address in the United States from North Tonawanda. I guess that is in the New York state. And the ISP of this IP is Verizon Internet Service, which is a residential internet provider, which basically means it's a residential IP, which we can use for whatever. Okay, so let's draw some conclusions. The possible benefits of using GeoSurf is of course, is of course that their prices are less than of other competitive solutions. And another one is that you actually get access to these 2 million of residential IPs worldwide. You are able to uh, have these sticky IPs, which do not change very, very often. And you are able to target your IPs on a city level, which is nice and cool. Plus, they don't have any domain restrictions, which basically means you can use it for any website that you want. It, this includes Google, Facebook and other big sites as well. Possible downside for GeoSurf is that currently that they don't have uh, an ability to target on an ISP level, so that if you want an IP address, let's say from AT&T, you won't be able to do it with GeoSurf. However, they claim that they are already working on it. Okay, thanks very much for watching this video till the end. As promised, there is a small present for you. If you go to multilogin.com slash proxy and go to residential IPs, you will see that there is a get a deal uh, button on in the GeoSurf uh, section. This means that if you purchase GeoSurf via our referral link, you will get one month of multilogin solo plan for free. To get access to it, go to multilogin.com slash GeoSurf proxy, where you will need to enter your multilogin multi application email, click get a deal button, then you will need to click on our referral link, purchase GeoSurf residential proxy service, and after that, please contact our support so we can assign you a free one month of the solo plan. And I guess that is it. Thanks very much for watching. Make sure that you subscribe to our Telegram channel and our YouTube channel to get notified about the latest videos. Bye.